Good afternoon, folks. Steve Rhodes coming to you live from the shores of very pleasant and sunny Delray Beach, Florida. This year, 2 p.m. update, clearly of all the U.S. indices trading to the downside. The Dow's up 186 points. That's half a percent. S&P down 1 percent. That's 45 points. And then NASDAQ 100, 306. Russell's down 26. The semis are off 64. That's 2 percent. Tranny's down 3 and a half percent or 524 points out there. Gold's off 4 bucks. Silver down 8 cents. Lights Recruit is off $5.63. She's trading out at 96 dollars and 38 pennies so what do we want to do here i think what we're going to do is go to my my normal market update chart that we take a look at at one o'clock we didn't get a chance to do that today and take a look at really the critical elements here it just really kinds of sums it up so to speak from the equity market standpoint and that's the upper row the upper row has got the es mini in the left hand side price is pulled back and is tested and so far rejected the bottom of its daily profile that is support 44.52 the price closed below 44.52. We'd be looking at a run to 43.83. Spot volatility has tested so far rejected as 50-day exponential moving average. That says that the support is held in the ES Mini, resistance is held in the uh, spot volatility, and you should see a further bounce from here. The NQ has tested support or virtually tested support. The bottom of its daily profile, 14.391. Price got down to 14.420. So in essence, at this stage here, support is held for the ES, support is held for the NQ, and resistance is held in the spot volatility exit. Maybe a different picture at 4 p.m., but right now at 2.01, it's telling you that uh, the key levels have held. You got the U.S. dollar index, which is taking on the top of its daily profile, 99.47. A close above that on a weekly basis says the U.S. dollar index continues to was higher. Uh, you've got gold, which has basically been trading sideways for a couple of weeks. Silver's been trading sideways to lower for a couple of weeks. You can see the lights we crude is beginning, is taking out. It's testing at least the bottom of its bullish structured daily profile, 99.41. And price closes below that. That suggests to move lower. Now, a move lower might not be that much lower because it would target the March 15th area, and that's in the 90. 220 level. Uh, natural gas out here. Today is going to become bar number nine of a TD nine count. That's as a, a top. Could or should form between today and tomorrow. And the 30 year Treasury, she's trade lower below all kinds of support, suggests that it wants to move lower as well. Folks, stay tuned. Your favorite polar bear, David White, is up next. Thanks so much for joining us. Have a wonderful Wednesday. I'll see you back here at about one o'clock sharp on Thirsty Thursday. Take care.